believe that the best is yet to come. You got to start believing that the best is yet to come. The best is yet to come. The best that you might be going through hell and high water right now, but the best is yet to come. Your heart might be broken right now, but the best is yet to come. You might be tired and wore out right now, but the best is yet to come. You better open up your eyes and you better start looking into the eyes of faith and just saying within yourself, the best is yet to come. As a matter of fact, even in this season of Christmas, you need to start saying the best is yet to come. Things are about to turn. Tell somebody, prophesy to them, things are about to turn around for you. Come on, tell them, tell them. Your head might be hung down now, but baby, things are about to turn around from you. You need to touch them and encourage them right now. And say the best is yet to come. Come on, nudge them a little bit and say the best is yet to come. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell them, I know you've been through it. I know you've been hurt. I know you've been disappointed. But baby, the best is yet to come. As a matter of fact, your shout gonna come back. Your praise gonna come back. Your money gonna come back. Your good feeling gonna come back. Because the best is yet to come. I dare you to high five two people and tell them the best, 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 the best. Why? Why? Prove that. Why is the best yet to come? Because the Bible says. That we can do all things through Christ who gives us strength. And so that means that if I'll believe him, whew, if I'll start to believe him, deep down on the inside, my faith is going to be activated. And when my faith is activated, no devil in hell can keep me from reaching the goal that God has for me. And so the best is yet to come. You might look at me and say, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But the best is yet to come. Things right now, even as I speak, have already gotten better. Things right now are moving toward the direction that God wants them to move. I ain't going to let the enemy make me hold my head down. As a matter of fact, you ought to get next to somebody and say, excuse me, I don't mean to offend you, but... Hold your head up. Come on. Jump. Come on. Say, hold your head. You need to get your head. You hold your head up. Your mind will go up. You hold your head up. Your thoughts will go up. You need to hold your. Stop sitting there with your head down. Stop sitting there like you don't know what you're doing. Hold your head up. I wish you nudge your neighbor and tell your neighbor, it's time to hold your head up. Come on. Hold it up. Woo! I'm almost done. 